Hello everybody, I'm Crafty Game of the Crafty Family and today this is the second episode of the Season of the Chosen questline. I don't even know, honestly. But um, yeah, I'm going to record, like I probably mentioned in the last episode, right after I'm done. And yeah, it's been like, what, 10 minutes for me or a bit more? Now my family has begun to be a bit more active in the background but I've run two tests uh, to check my vo voice and I think it may be a bit low um, well you've probably noticed it by now and I as well because I'll have edited by then by the time this episode since is online the first one will also have been edited and I would have noticed by myself but I think my voice may be a bit low but normally now it should be alright and as for my background noises um, my sister in the room next to me uh, is probably going to watch TV so normally it's quite loud but I've told her I'm going to record so maybe she'll try to be kind for me and try to be a bit more silent and not too loud and well yeah there's going to be music in my background as well but I've checked two times like I said and I haven't heard any of them so I think I'll be okay for background music for now but to be sure I'm going to tell you guys that if you guys hear it sorry I'll try to filter it out if possible but it's not really possible for me I mean I don't know unless I want to cut out the uh, audio of the well, of the game itself with like the background music and everything which I'll turn up again but it was quite loud and quite nice of a music but it's now a bit more normal but just now it was more of a new so just now it was a bit of a new version of this track but Right now I'm going to do the various things in the... Perhaps it's a bit too loud, sorry. Um, especially to hear myself. I don't want uh, music to be louder than my own voice, so yeah. But I'm going to do the various things so I can get started with challenges and everything. Because I want to do these 10 seasonal challenges. Yeah, seasonal challenges. So I'll probably... I think I'll start with this one because it's going to be a pain for me. Defeat Guardians in a Mayhem place with my super abilities. Now I know you'll get your super pretty fast. So the 50 isn't going to be that hard but it's going to It's more going to be like get a kill in the first place that's going to be hard for me. But to do that first I want to do all the small things and get all the small tasks and everything. And for that I'll first go to quests. Where we left, last left off last time. The Umbral Decoder and Prismatic Recaster have been appropriated by the Vanguard and relocated to the Helm. Visit the Umbral Decoder to obtain the Decrypting the Darkness quest and then complete it. So yeah, we've, we're going to here to get this quest. Um, Guardian. When the Dark Fleet arrived, it changed many things. Including Engrams. Some of them now have now be we have much what we have much diff behave oh sorry <laughs> um, some of them now behave much differently than before the cryptarchy the cryptarchy needs your help in studying these changes of all the unlikely sources it was the drifter who first created a device for al altering umbral emblems now the cryptarchy the cryptarchy is using his design as the basis for further research we will provide you with the equipment for further research on these umbral engrams. In return, please help us by recording the results of your experiments. Tyra Karn. Decrypting the darkness. Pick up a message from Tyra Karn at the umbral decoder in the helm. Tyra Karn's message. What? Oh, damn. Let's try to take that up again. I hope I can. Come on. Um, yeah, I skipped that without doing it on purpose. When the Black Fleet arrived, the Cryptarch, 
Cryptarchy discovered that umbral engrams and legendary engrams are generated through similar processes. How and why the engram engrams change is still a mystery. However, we, are we now have a tool for controlling the content contents of these umbral engrams. We call them prismatic lenses. The drifter has yet to divulge how they are constructed, and truth told, it's possible he doesn't know either. Here's the final prismatic lens remaining from our previous studies. It's quite fragile, and we estimate it has a single charge left before it breaks. Take it, along with this umbral engram, and try the focusing process for yourself. Tara Karin. A limited use price prismatic lens with the ability focus to focus an umbral engram. Remaining uses one. Yeah, I think that's going to be a bit more of a pain to get. I oh, it's a prime that I have right there. I was already thinking, what's that that's coming up? So it's going to be a pain, but you have to go here now. But next time we probably don't have to go to the decoder. And umbral affinity, vendor subscreen, then weapon focusing. And see what we can get. Like these four weapons, a linear fusion rifle, a fusion rifle, a scout rifle and a shotgun. It's all quite all right. Um, so let's just go. Damn, five legendary shirts. I don't want to spend too much on those. I like to spare those. It's probably pretty logical. Um, now, now I have to go back to here, to the decoder, and now I can decode it. Fragile prismatic lens, a focused umbral engram will contain forged weapons from Red War. Ah, so only reforging like. What was it called again? Um, focusing. That it costs things. Let's see. This one I can do it normally. Yes, but it's not. Uh, it's the ignoring hunger from the season of uh, arrivals. All right. The focus of these umbral engrams remains a source of fascination. The potential applications are endless. I'm still wary of interacting so closely with the darkness, but you can no longer avoid it. Do you think the dark fleet is attempting to communicate through these lenses and engrams? There's still much to learn. Return to the helm with any prismatic lenses or umbral engrams. And let's continue our research together. Tarek Karin. God damn it. My inventory is a bit full right now. Let's see which one will I delete. Um, damn. I think all of them are quite nice. This one. This one's one of my favorites. Then. This one I don't care that much about, and this one here, this one's pretty nice, this one's too bright to my liking, to be honest. This one as well, um, this one, yeah, just store it as well, um, then I'll keep these three. I don't know why, I don't really change, I only change to new ones from time to time, um, but yeah, let's take this one. Prismatic Recaster. In the hands of the Cryptarchy, Guardians with prismatic lances may use a variety of material to focus umbral engrams, focusing the contents into equipment. Alright, so there's nothing really to do here right now. Points next round 2%. Huh. Let's see what's what is that requester right now. Active season. Um, a collection of focusing options from Season of the Chosen, unlocked by discovering prismatic lenses. I see. So, tier 1 focusing, uh, worldly weapons, contain le legendary weapons found in several activities and destinations. I'm not going to take all the names, but... Focused, um, an engram containing a Season of the Chosen submachine gun or sidearm. An engram containing the season of the chosen bow or sniper, sniper rifle. Um, acquired chests. Acquired from tribute chests. Ah, I think I'm starting to get this. This is more like a guide on how to get them. Alright. And this one doesn't either. Oh, too bad. I wish I could see which weapons we could get from them, but no. Alright, that's quite interesting. Now, let's go to here and start recording this as well.
The dragon of your light roars over Nessus. Our enemies fear you, Guardian. Osiris mentioned you crashed a Cabal ritual they call the Rite of Proving. He seems to think it's not unlike our Crucible, made for settling scores. I don't see the resemblance. Scraps of the Red Legion are competing to earn Keitel's favor. Just like her, their hands are tied by tradition. They're forced to meet every challenger or forfeit their position. We can exploit that. I want you to run down every Cabal commander you can find. If they're foolhardy enough to accept a fistfight with you, Keitel's War Council won't fill a single seat. To that end, Crow has spotted another of the Empress's hopefuls on Europa. They call him Basilius the Golem. He's looking for Golden Age relics to excavate from the ice. Basilius intends to augment his body and offer combat enhancements to other Cabal. If he succeeds, it won't be long before Keitel has an entire platoon of Exo Legionaries at her disposal. Get in the way. Alright, but I don't think I will do this this episode. I'm not completely sure. But alright, challenge is proving. Europa holds a treasure trove of technological and paracausal assets. Right now a cabal commander named Basilus is skul skulking through the ice looking for anything he can find to present to the Empress. Saladin wants you to find him and disrupt his search by challenging him to combat. Either he fights you and dies, or he runs in his horn, and this honor does the rest. That's quite easy, I suppose. Now, I n remember being uh, an, a triumph for getting all six mods of this season, so I'm definitely going to take those. I mean, I already have by now, but I'm going to look this through first. Increase your rank with the reward table by competing certain season of challenges and season of chosen. Points in extra rank, 1000, alright, and can I see what I can get? Oh, no, I can't, alright. Um, successfully complete the battlegrounds, defeat combatants from the post, combatants and battlegrounds are a lot more. Defeat Arcus with Mila Bellet in this defeat. Defeat, defeat targets with energy weapons, defeat competence in battlegrounds, and defeat guardians. And defeated guardians are worth more. And repeatable. But I'm not going to take those repeatable because I'll have quite enough to deal with already in a second. Um, now, as for this challenge, can I see what exactly this challenge is right now? Um, I can't. Damn. It's not an open area, I think, but oh well. So for now, I'll think I'll go to here. There's nothing left for me to do at uh, the helm. Let's see. This time, I did remember on which time I started recording, so we should be about 13, 14 minutes, or a bit less. But all right. So let's see if. We'll 10 to 50. Alright, so it's about 27 minutes I should try to record. Maybe I shouldn't really talk about timing on my recordings, but I don't really care that much right now. Alright, so as I've probably mentioned in the previous was it called um, the previous episode sorry um, of the season of the chosen I've said that the new stuff will mostly be done on my hunter like right now and the others things that I've done before will be done on my Titan yes so right now guardians are always welcome when Let's this go. episode is being uploaded it should be Saturday for me at least and there should be one episode of Forsaken left. That is in the the, the Titan. And Hello, Welcome. let's see. Um, yeah, it was for the Titans, so it's probably 
This is going to stay that way. Everything from Forsaken, Shadow Keep, and Beyond Light will be on Forsaken. Unless it's new stuff from the. Um, me. I'm going to take this exotic bow to a test ride. <laughs> um, un unless it's new stuff like the new aspects and everything. That thing I'll probably be doing on the. No, actually, I think I won't. Fun. I will. Any at all. Hmm. Have to I have to that. think about that. I'm not completely sure. I might have to first do some. Damn, it's really confusing. I'll see. I'll see it later. I'm not going to try and talk about this right now because I don't even know what I'll do. Um, I've got a catalyst for that bow of yours, Banshee Forty Four says. I think I've always had it, but I don't remember getting it. All right, charge the catalyst with energy, and I'll work it. I'll work on it for you. But next time, can you just bring me a regular gun, nothing that collapses timelines or whatever? Right, no time to explain. <laughs> Messy business. Um, Bench for the fortunes an unfinished weapon frame as you approach him. A lot of things coming to light recently. Maybe it's best to put it out of your head and focus on sim on simple things. Banshee looks up from your work, from his work. Get everything in tune before moving forward. You know, here's your kit. Keep them on the on their heels. Yeah, this is the quest I mentioned in the last episode. Um, earn points by defeating combatants in Crucible Gambit on Strike play playlists. Significant bonus progress for grenade and grenade launcher final blows. Also complete Crucible, Gambit and Strike matches. Bonus progress for Crucible and Gambit wins. Or Nightfall Strikes. Pretty state for it, yeah? Yeah, but it's kind of big as well. Now, let's see what do we've got here. Gunsmiths. Um, I don't get the weapon telemetry, but whatever. And this thing isn't really that. Oh, great! Now I can see which level I am at. Wait, what? Where are the weekly? Are there no weekly anymore? Or is it just me being retarded or something? Don't get burned. Or is it this week? Just this week Only since it's the first one. But this wouldn't make sense because everyone would, would want to. I'm mumbling to myself from time to time. Sorry. Ah. Uh, well, anyway, let's quickly go to this guy. Hi See there. what do I have left. Um, a ship. Let's see, how does it look? Huh, not that special to me. Mm, then again, let's see. Gone. Gone. Right! Whenever you My need gear! Again, I totally forgot about thinking about that. Um, yeah, the gear I got from this should be stronger, so I'll put that on for now. But really only for now, because I'll quickly try to upgrade and get stronger. So I can get my good gear again. <laughs> no, this one I'm going to hold for now. Um, that's all things I need to hold. Um, these rare ones I don't give a damn about. <laughs> I should watch my words probably. Uh, this one's not that good. Can go. These are the most important, and this one I need for certain something. And this one is uh, yeah, it's just one level higher, but it isn't that special anymore since the new cap is here. Is here. Um, let's see. Special, special. What? What's about this one again? Nothing. All right. Um, special, not even that special, probably just, uh, that was beyond the hard cap that it's, that I kept it. These ones are quite good and needed, um, Please, Guardian, it's busy. It. um, yeah, that's my special one, special one, um, not needed, not needed. Not needed, alright. And then for this, let's see. Um, well, the mostly annoying part is the one in which I we only have one for now. 
for the barrier the scout rifle that's going to be a pain or a sniper but I don't really like to use a sniper too much and besides it's not that nice for to have a sniper against a barrier champion that can literally protect himself from any damage Eververse isn't just a title because if you and and regenerate health it's really not that Hi again. nice I mean just a few days ago I tried uh what's it called Ready, uh, a master lost sector and like there was a barrier champion the first one and I couldn't kill him because maybe my light level was too low so I didn't do that much damage but by the time I broke his shield his barrier he had regained all of his health so it was quite impossible so I had to quit eventually I tried to running past him but like another spawn right next to him like telling me like if you can't beat me a barrier champion you're not going to get this so fuck off shouldn't have said it out loud probably Damn. <laughs> um, but well. Alright, um, well, what will I do right now? Let's see on the map, is there still anything I should do? I hope that that will be gone now because it's really bugging me it's always this notification like it's something new but I know what it is the only thing new now is that there are, that there are two new weapons here for all I know the whisper of the worm and the outbreak perfected which I already have and also this one here like the duality is now a weapon you can reobtain if you didn't before and then here there might be a new ones but I'm not even that sure as well as for these but I'm pretty sure these ones were there but in the live chat they said it wasn't <laughs> that's all well oh right so here this also fell winter sly there's also a new weapon that's here no damn it's still here oh, I'm getting annoyed um now what else is there to do let's see 20 minutes left what am i gonna do should i stop the recording here and start doing things for myself or will i try to do the story a bit more i might do that actually since i'm going to record that anyway so investigate cabal movements on europa via the battleground hailstone activity battleground hailstone completed um messy business um oh that's not that and then for this Siphon energy for the Tikus definition catalyst by collecting orbs of power, defeating comrades and defeating guardians. Alright, that's not that big, I suppose. And once I get a few levels, it will be twice as fast and even more levels and be four times as fast. But for now, Challenger's proving is the one we'll be doing for now. I guess I'll do this battleground on Europa and I'll see where it leads off, but I know those activities aren't that short, so I I expect that it. Uh, damn it! Um, I'm gonna stop talking for one second and try to rethink how I speak. <sighs> All right, so I don't think this will be just ten minutes or so. So. I mean, there's literally a triumph for doing this in less than 10 minutes, so I doubt I'll get it that fast and that easy. So the video will probably have to end by the time I'm done with this, or perhaps speaking again at the helm with people. I don't even know if you have to speak to people. I don't know anything beyond this point from what's going to happen, because this is the point where my updates had finally been done, and I finally could start recording, and I finally did so I obviously shut down my PC with the YouTube uh, live and haven't seen the guy since <laughs> and uh, by the way for the ways I'm going to record for now I've been thinking like Wednesday will always be for now at least I'll try to do twice a week to upload and Wednesday will be uh, 
Wednesday will be about uh, campaigns Forsaken, um, Shadow Keep, and Beyond Light. And perhaps by the time Beyond Light is finally completely done and uploaded, the, the new, the Witch Queen, next year will be coming out and I'll be able to record that. But as for other things, for Saturday, it will be mostly for Season of the Hunt. So, but I don't think I'll be able to keep every week of new content. So the Cabal I'll probably is isolated around a nearby Vex structure. They haven't yet had a chance to fabricate heavy fortifications. The Vex are agitated. Expect their interference as well. Go show them the power of humanity's champions. So like I said um, before I got interrupted, I'll try mainly to record for the season of the chosen on for Saturday videos and I won't have quests for every week. I'll try to take uh, whenever there's new things. I'll definitely put that in the video for that episode. But other than that, I'll mostly try to work it out. Um, well, I'll probably do those weekly uh, seasonal challenges and try to explain what to do if it's and try to show some clips of it. It's probably what I'm going to do. And in the future, when I'm done with Beyond Light and perhaps even Witch, the Witch Queen, if I'm not done with it yet. Also, my la my my damn audio is way too loud right now. I'm going to have to reset that. It's really loud. It's seriously hurting my ears a bit. But after Beyond Light and maybe Witch Queen, if um by then it's already out. Um, let's see. Music volume. Damn it! Um, there, that should be enough. Um, like, like I was trying to say, um, I'll probably be doing new things, like informational videos as well. So, triumphs and tutorials and such things will probably be out once I'm done with the campaigns, mostly. So. I might even next year still be uploading from Beyond the Light, but or Forsaken even because yeah, I want to, I want to do those. Those look inter it, lo it looks interesting to me to try and record things and try and help people with by showing them what they have to do in the way I see fit as a good video because when I look online, half the time isn't that clear to me and perhaps to you guys as well and I just wanted to be clear to everyone and yeah it, it'll probably be quite long videos also it's not going to be like a bunch of short videos god damn it there goes a uh, I was trying to do this without dying because that's a triumph as well but yeah I feel like that but yeah long videos for tutorials because I want to explain everything but that's not for now and the only tutorial I'll be uploading anytime soon is the one I'm working on right now and it's more like waiting for my cousin to be able to send his videos to me so I can edit them and it's mostly about the nine, nine, uh, three times nine collectibles for from Europa the, I'm not going to say them I'm not going to explain them really but I'll probably won't be able to rely on them for that much longer, so I'll... But yeah, I'm going to shut, about the shut up about that right now and start speaking more about what I'm going to do right now. Or rather, I'll shut up and kill these guys because they're starting to annoy me. Plus, I'm also getting a sore throat from speaking too much. Never happened before. Mostly because I don't talk that much. So I didn't really notice that the areas of the, these battlegrounds are similar to, or like in the same areas, the maps themselves. I thought it would be whole new locations. 
but perhaps it's not every time like that or the first one in all right am i back now i hope i am because i really don't know what's happening but like my recording it seems like when i try to record again after having a 30 minute cap the recording stops instantly again so like i click i double tap on share to start my recording and i get the message start recording but then instantly after that it says um, recordings ended and yeah but i should be okay for now again so you have to find out what it is Seriously, getting a sword card from talking. What the hell? By the way, I'm also going to try and get more of the triumphs on my weapon kills. So I'll try to use special kind of weapon, specific kind of weapon from time to time, but not everything, I'm not going to completely focus on it, more like a passive goal of my own while I'm recording and not recording so that wasn't good. and while I'm at it, I might as well try to get used to these guns and all these kind of weapons because some of them I'm not that good at using but I can always improve I suppose and knowing how to use everyone is always a good idea to me look at this picking apart the vex like carrion birds it's pathetic there is no glory in what the cabal are seeking here just desperation agreed This one's a bit longer I think, than the the other one. I think it's really going to take 20 minutes like I thought it would. After this episode I won't be recording instantly again and I'm not going to continue the storyline because I mostly want to do those challenges right now. Um, I want to record really but I'm not going to force the things I want to do because of recording um, how should I say it I'm not going to spoil my own fun in my games just so I can record it accordingly I just I'll just stop the quest line and do whatever I want right now that's not things I need to record or I don't know I'll start a new recording or record a clip I'll put in another video later but I'm not going to like I said force myself to do things this legion's too much at least here, guardian perform the right of proving call him out and show him the power of the light I wonder how many of them there are. Now, does every one of them? Yeah, every one of them takes a shield. Shield, yeah. Also, oh damn. Yeah. 
Yeah, my aim isn't that good right now. But like, I move too much when I'm using my super, so... I have to keep trying and aim at him because in an instant I'll go behind him and then I'll just go straight to the wall. And that's not really convenient. So, no, which kind of... Right, if I do this I'll probably... Yep, nice, invisibility. Always one of my favorites. Oh, he's dead. Huh. Hammer of proving. I can use this for the the focusing. Yeah, for the focusing. I remember. We should send in another team to do a second sweep. Today's survivor is tomorrow's enemy. Did the Vanguard not have a loosely held policy on offering quarter to fleeing enemies? The Vanguard asked an Iron Lord to lead their forces. If they did not wish me to fight like an Iron Lord, they should have asked someone else. While I agree, I can't help but wonder if your disregard for their codes of conduct may cause friction. Friction is conflict. Conflict breeds strength. They know this. Or they should. In my experience, what the Vanguard should know, and what they actually know, are not always the same. You speak the truth, Warlock. My only hope is that they have not forgotten the Battle of Twilight Gap and the lessons learned there. I'm seriously wondering what the Battle of Twilight Gap was. I have no idea. I'm guessing it's something from see Destiny 1. But I don't know. It's because I haven't played Destiny 1, unfortunately. I may buy it in the future, but I'm not going to do anything special right now. Now, what's this? Huh? Instant an access to the exotic bow. Alright, I know that. Universal, universal armor ornaments. Exotic bow ornaments. It, the ornaments for the bow looks kind of sick. It's rank 100, so I'll definitely get to it faster than the last last mission and new stasis abilities and things um, return to the helm and visit the war table to in investigate the ceremony hammer you found right but before that ooh, I've already got a new power bonus it's nice small chance to earn additional cabal gold from strikes gamut crucible and public events Upgrade modules, I'm not short on them right now, but I will be in a moment. So it's always nice to have some extra. Now, let's see, what do I have right now? Um, let's see, combat is defeated, done. Guardian is defeated, not yet. Orbs of power collected, 14 of the 100. Nice, it's already going quite further than I thought it would. Um, defeat targets with melee abilities. Yeah, that's going to be hard since my melee ability isn't even a damaging type. Not right now, at least. But let's see. Mm. There are quite some things I need to do, but I'll do those off cam. Al although I might try to do those on cam as well. Hmm. I'll see what I do, but. No, I think I will record it. So, like. That's the one thing I'll try to record at least, and that's the last part for... Where is it? Um, I'm going to end the video in a minute, by the way. Um, oh damn, so now it's 18, huh? Um, here. Secrets. I've done most of them. Training complete, the tree simulations, it isn't that hard once you've done the first. It's like every week there will be an another one of the tree. Then this one is just collecting nine ping rings, collecting nine dead exo bodies, and collect the nine uh, destroy the nine entropic shards. That's that, and then everything else is more augments, and that's this one. This one is needed for a triumph. Um, complete all the augment triumphs, so, so like do every one of these, and one of these can complete it each week only one. I don't know if that sentence was right, but like every week you get the um, chance to do this, 
at a specific location and I'll record it in a minute or like later I'll record it when I'm doing this last one why didn't I think of doing that when I was doing these everything these others but like every week you can do only one of them like you see right here terminals activated three you have to buy something with varix basically and you get to do act you have to do something and then you can activate three terminals each week and you can only buy one of that item it's a transponder um, you can only buy it once a week so yeah you can really only do one triumph a week of these eight I think yeah eight so it's eight weeks as it takes but it isn't it hard but also you can actually do more at once like if for example at eternity and Bray exercise you first time did two here and one here you can get both triumphs next time when you do the last one here and the last two here I accidentally <laughs> did that actually um, also my triumphs let's see 15 defeat cabal while wearing season of the chosen armor this is the kind of triumphs I want to do on cam actually but like obviously I won't do what am I even saying I'm not going to do all of this on cam more like acquiring them damn it my speaking is really bad today and my thinking even worse um, I meant completing them like showing them I've got them and the hard ones I'll try to do on cam but let's see what do I got here nothing special like is there a soft cap right now because the seasonal limit is only risen by like 50 so 50 or 60 no actually yeah only 50 so is it like from 50 to 300 uh, 250 to 300 like the hard cap and then less than pinnacle cap hmm it's a mystery to me because I'll search it up later but this was it for you guys anyway um, this was it guys <laughs> damn I seem to be stuck on trying to talk in a specific way but like this is the end of the video guys um, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed and thank you guys for watching um, see you guys later and bye I suppose <laughs>